Welcome everyone, here we are with the Clubman Cup Plus, one of the new races outside of the two new menu books added in update 1.40, and this particular race comes from the online multiplayer. This race has been featured in Daily Race A a few times, and now has been added to single player as a one lap race, the two differences are, there is no nitrous allowed and the wide selection of cars. I settled on using the Bugatti Veyron, but not after a few failed attempts, since you can only only have 720 pp i needed to figure out which car to use and how to adjust the specs to have the speed needed to win here are a couple attempts of me losing in second place the corvette is fast but just couldn't quite make it and the veyron before i made some adjustments this was the closest i got about a foot behind here are the final adjustments I made that got me the win. I raised the total speed from 420 to 430, a simple step to make, and I removed the braking system and pads to help with the performance points. You start this race in P12, instead of being in last place, which doesn't matter at all in this race, and you'll move up the field very quickly. The AI driving actually differs from race to race, so their positions can be totally different from a previous race you may have done. Sometimes the field might split into two packs, or they might stay all together till the end. The RX-7 starts off with some quick acceleration, but falls off eventually and joins the pack, and with the simple raising of your total speed from 420 to 430, lets you put some distance on them when you get P1. And it's clear sailing to the finish line from there on, the field won't fall far behind, but won't be able to catch up to you. Going into the first turn, the RX-7 is still with me for now, but I ended up cutting him off, and he backed off quite a bit. Over halfway through the race, and I've got the distance needed now. Here is the view from the back of the field. The Lamborghini that beat me before is in last place this time. The field is bunched up, and they are all trying to draft off each other to pick up speed. Now we'll take a look at P2, and how far behind he is from me. The Pagani happens to be in P2 right now, but the AI have been switching positions a lot. They seem to be having some really good battles for the position, and you can see me ahead, and them not gaining. And please like, comment, and subscribe. A simple click for you is a big deal to the channel and helps it grow. Appreciate your support. Thank you. And here at the end, entering the tunnel, approaching the finish line, with no worries about the AI, and a pretty easy win with the simple changes made to the car. See you next time.